Yeah. Uh, hello everyone, my, my name is Famous and today I'm going to be starting this, uh, a topic uh, which is uh, pyrimidine uh, biosynthesis. So uh, let's get to the board. So the reaction begins with a condensation reaction. So CPS1 which is carbomyl, carbomyl phosphate synthetase 2 enzyme, it condenses uh, carbon dioxide, glutamine and ATP to produce carbo, uh, carbomyl phosphates. So this is the first step of uh, the pyrimidine uh, uh, synthesis. So from there, the second step involves uh, condensation of carbomyl uh, phosphate and aspartate through the en enzyme aspartate transcarbomylase to produce uh, carbomyl uh, aspartate. That's the second step. Now, this first uh, step is the regulatory uh, step of uh, pyrimidine uh, biosynthesis. Why the second, uh, why the second enzyme uh, aspartate uh, uh, transcarbomylase, is the which is the second step, is the rate limiting step of this reaction. Now we have CPS1. CPS1 is found in the urea cycle, but this that uh, CPS1 is actually is a mitochondria uh, enzyme. Why this one? It is cytosolic enzyme, meaning it found in the cytosol. CPS2 uh, 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 is found in the cytosol. And CPS1, which is found in the urea cycle, it's found in the, in actually it's found in the outermost in, in the outermost part of the inner mitochondria, which is in the it's a mitochondria uh, enzyme. So carbomyl uh, carbomyl uh, aspartate is being converted to dihydrohydrotase through the enzyme uh, dihydrotase. So uh, dihydrotase uh, aspartate transcarbomylase and uh, CPS2. They are all form uh, a, a complex which we call a, a CAD uh, a, a functional uh, a, a enzyme of a CAD fu uh, functional uh, complex. So from there we proceed. Uh, the hydrohorotase converts uh, uh, the hydrohorotate to orotic acid. So the hydrohorotase converts the hydro uh, the hydrohorotate to orotic acid. So this conversion is being uh, is being catalyzed by hydrohorotate dehydrogenase. The conversion of uh, this uh, dehydrohorotate to orotic acid is being catalyzed by dehydrohorotate dehydrogenase uh, enzyme. The orotic acid is being converted to UT, uh, UDP. This orotic acid is being converted to U, uh, uh, UDP. But we are uh, it's, uh, through the enzyme uh, uh, UMP synthase. Now this UMP synthase is just uh, it's a combination of uh, OMP and uh, OPROT. OMP it's a uh, uh, orodidylate uh, monophosphate. Why uh, uh, OPROP is a uh, OPROT is orodidylate orodidylate uh, pyro. Uh, 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 or, or, or delete, uh, uh, phosphoribose transferase. So that that's the full meaning. So uh, this uh, UMP is being is being converted to uh, uh, uridine uh, diphosphate. Then uridine diphosphate is being uh, converted to UTP, which is uh, uridine uh, triphosphate. Then uridine triphosphate is being converted to uh, uh, Cytidine uh, 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 diphosphate. So, as we said, pyrimidine biosynthesis is just the production of RNA and DNA and DNA. So, it is at this junction uh, UTP is leads to RNA production. So, CTP leads to uh, uh, RNA production also. So, at this point. Uh, uh, ATP and glutamine comes in to assist in this reaction. Why? What the enzyme that catalyzes this uh, uh, the conversion of uh, uridine triphosphate to to CTP? It's called uh, CTP uh, synthase. This CTP synthase converts uh, UTP to uh, to CTP. So from there we continue. UDP is being converted to uh, the oxy uh, uridine diphosphate through the enzyme. Ribonucleic, uh, ribonucleotide reductase. 
So uh, this uh, uh, DU, uh, DUDP is being converted to the oxyuridine monophosphate. So the oxyuridine monophosphate is being converted to the, the uh, uh, DTMP. That is the oxy uh, uh, trimonophosphate. The oxy thiamine thiamine uh, monophosphate. This is the oxy thiamine uh, 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 monophosphate. Now, this reaction, this conversion of DUMP to DTMP is being uh, is being catalyzed by a uh, thiamidylate synthase. Now. This thiamidylate synthase it needs a uh, folic acid, which is a uh, vitamin uh, 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 vitamin B nine for for it to function effectively. So uh, this uh, uh, N five uh, N ten methylene tetrahydrofolate it it it's needed for uh, uh, thiamidylate uh, thiamidylate synthase to function effectively. Effectively, and a, a, a tetrahydrofolate is being uh, formed through the uh, through um, dihydrofolate. So dihydrofolate is actually uh, converted to tetrahydrofolate. And what enzyme uh, does this? Uh, dihydrofolate uh, reductase. It assists uh, dihydrofolate to be converted to tetrahydrofolate, which assists this thiamidylate uh, synthase to convert DUMP to DTMP. So DTMP. It uh, is being converted to DTDP. Then DTP, DDTP is being converted to DTTP. Then from there, it enters a, it enters a, a DNA uh, uh, production. So now, I'll, I'll go back to this. The uh, purine, purine synthesis, it, it's be, uh, purine enters, uh, it, uh, it is at this point that this, uh, this uh, phosphoribose uh, py pyrophosphate, it, uh, it, uh, it combines with, uh, 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 through this uh, exhaust uh, monophosphate shunt. So it, it uh, ribosphite phosphate combines with ribosphite phosphate, ribosphite phosphate combined with uh, phosphoribose V uh, uh, pyrophosphate through the enzyme phosphoribose uh, 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 synthetase. See, I'll take that, take that again. Ribose 5-phosphate, ribose 5-phosphate through the hexose monophosphate shunt is being, uh, uh, through the hexose monophosphate shunt is being converted to uh, phosphoribose pyrophosphate through the enzyme phosphoribose pyrophosphate synthetase. Now, it is from this junk phosphoribose synthetase is being converted to uh, uh, IMP. Then from IMP is being converted to uh, GMP. So that, that it, uh, it, it, this pathway has to do with uh, the purine uh, 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 synthesis pathway. So, but we're going to, I'm going to make another video that talks about it completely. But now, I talked about, uh, now, these are the enzymes, uh, CPS2, which is the regulatory enzyme, aspartate transcarbomylase, which is the rate limiting enzyme. And I talked about uh, the hydro uh, the uh, hydrotase, which conver uh, converts carbomyl aspartate to dihydro uh, uh, orotate. So, then this DHO, uh, the hydrohorotate, uh, the hydrohorotate, the hydrogenate, it converts this uh, dihydrohorotate to uh, orotic acid. Then this uh, complex, which is UMP, uh, uh, UMP synthase, it converts uh, uh, orotic acid to this UDP. Now, if there is, if there is a defect in uh, this uh, UMP synthase, which is either this or this. That means this reaction will not continue. And the, if this reaction does not continue, it means there will be accumulation of orotic acid, which could lead, which could lead to uh, orotic uh, acidu aciduria. If there's a defect in either of these or both of the it could lead to accumulation of orotic acid, which is orotic, which would cause, which would cause orotic uh, aciduria. Now, there are some drugs that, uh, that hinders some steps in this uh, 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 
pyrimidine biosynthesis. Now, leflunomide, leflunomide, it, it hinders this uh, uh, the orotated uh, dehydrogenase. Leflunomide, it hinders. So we shouldn't forget. We should, you see, because I'm trying to make this topic as high yield as, as possible. Leflunomide, it hinders uh, uh, dihydro, uh, orotate dehydrogenase. Why uh, hydroxyurea? It hinders, it hinders uh, 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 ribon, uh, ribonucleotide uh, reductase. And if, if this ribonucleotide reductase is being hindered by hydro, uh, uh, hydroxyurea, it's going to affect the production of DNA. Because this, this, uh, these steps, these steps will be hindered. So this hydroxyurea, it could hinder, it could hinder the production of uh, uh, the, syn the synthesis or production of uh, of uh, uh, of, uh, of the DNA. So for this uh, f fluorouracil uh, uh, f fluorouracil it hinders f fluorouracil uh, and capecitabine. It it directly hinders uh, uh, thymidylate synthase. These two, uh, these two drugs directly hinders uh, thymidylate synthase. Then this MTP, which is a uh, methotrexate, methotrexate, trimetoprim, and pyrimetamine, it hinders, it directly hinders uh, uh, the hydro uh, DHF uh, reduct reductase. This uh, um, um, methotrexate, methotrexate, trimetoprim and pyrimetamine it hinders the production of uh, the the conversion because if this enzyme is being hindered that means this uh, 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 tetrahydrofolate is being uh, is being hindered also that means there will be accumulation of this this one is being hindered and if this is being hindered it has direct effect on the uh, thymidylate synthase which will also have effect on on the dna production so this uh, this one uh, it indirectly affect thymidylase synthase indirectly true because here we need uh, folic acid the uh, thymidylase synthase need folic acid for it to function effectively so this is this uh, uh, this uh, drugs it hinders it indirectly why five uh, fluorouracil and capecitabine it hinders uh, t uh, thymidylase uh, synthase uh, 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 directly so this is just this is just the basic uh, concept of uh, uh, pyrimidine uh, uh, biosynthesis. So I have covered the reaction from the beginning to the end. Like as I said, I try to make it as high yield as possible. Now, question number one: What enzyme is the rate limiting enzyme of uh, pyrimidine biosynthesis? If you ask. What enzyme is the rate limiting enzyme of pyrimidine biosynthesis? The rate limiting enzyme in pyrimidine biosynthesis is aspartate transcarbomylase. Then another thing, what enzyme is the uh, regulatory? What enzyme is the, uh, is the regulatory? Uh, uh, what is the regulatory enzyme of pyrimidine biosynthesis? The answer is CPS2. The answer is CPS2. Now, CPS, uh, CPS2 is found in the mitochondria or in the cytosol. What is the answer? The answer to that is CPS2. It's a cytosolic uh, enzyme, so it is found in the cytosol because the whole of this reaction takes place in the cytosol. CPS1 is not found here. CPS1 is found in the urea cycle, which is found in the outermost part of the inner mitochondria. So it is a mitochondria. Uh, enzyme so what enzyme hinders the conversion of uh, UTP to CTP what enzyme what enzyme hinders the conversion the enzy enzyme that hinders the conversion is CTP synthase CTP synthase it hinders the conversion of U UTP to CTP now what enzyme uh, what enzyme catalyzes the conversion of DUMP to D T M P, the enzyme that catalyzes directly converts uh, D U M P to D T M P is thymidylate synthase. Now, 
the another question is this the uh, accumulation of uh, orotic acid urea is as a result of what enzyme orotic acid urea is a result of what enzyme a defect in what in what enzyme now orotic acid urea which is a defect in UMP synthase which is a defect Orotic acid urea is a defect in UMP synthase and as I said UMP synthase is a combination of uh, OMP the carboxylase and orodidylate uh, uh, phosphoribose transferase so once there is a defect in these two enzymes it leads to uh, orotic acid urea so I hope uh, this uh, my simple illustration makes sense what I'll be doing is in my second video I'm going to be talking about uh, the pyrene, uh, de novo pyrene biosynthesis and the salvage pathway so uh, thank you